Francis Parkinson Keyes's novel, Royal Box, explores themes of love, betrayal, and redemption against the backdrop of the glamorous yet treacherous world of high society. Set in England, the narrative weaves together the lives of several characters, each grappling with their desires, ambitions, and the consequences of their choices. The titular, Royal Box serves as a symbol of the elite world that these characters inhabit, a world where appearances often mask deeper, more complex realities. At the center of the novel is Lady Helen Beecham, a woman whose beauty and charm have secured her a prominent place in society. Yet beneath her polished exterior lies a deep sense of disillusionment and a longing for something more meaningful. Her marriage to Sir Arthur Beecham, a man of considerable wealth and influence, is one of convenience rather than love. This relationship underscores the novel's exploration of the constraints imposed by societal expectations, particularly on women, and the sacrifices they are often forced to make in the pursuit of security and status. Lady Helen's life takes a dramatic turn when she becomes involved with the dashing American diplomat, Robert T. Forrest. Their passionate affair offers her a glimpse of the love and excitement she has been missing, but it also places her in a precarious position. The affair is not merely a personal transgression but a scandal that threatens to unravel the carefully constructed facade of her life. Keyes uses this relationship to explore the tension between desire and duty, and the ways in which personal happiness is often at odds with societal norms. The novel also delves into the lives of other characters, such as Sir Arthur Beecham, whose ambition and desire for power drive him to make morally questionable decisions. His character is a study in the corrupting influence of power and the lengths to which individuals will go to maintain their status. The contrast between Sir Arthur and Robert Forrest is striking, while Sir Arthur is cold and calculating, Robert is passionate and idealistic, representing the allure of the unknown and the possibility of a different life. Another key figure in the novel is Margaret Winthrop, a woman of impeccable moral character who serves as a foil to Lady Helen. Margaret's unwavering adherence to her principles and her commitment to her family stand in stark contrast to Helen's pursuit of personal fulfillment at the expense of her duties. Through Margaret, Keyes examines the theme of sacrifice and the idea that true nobility lies not in one's social standing but in one's actions and integrity. The novel's climax centers around a dramatic confrontation in the royal box at the opera, a scene that symbolizes the convergence of the characters' public and private lives. In this moment, the masks that each character has been wearing are stripped away, revealing the raw emotions and vulnerabilities that lie beneath. The opera itself, with its themes of love, betrayal, and tragedy, serves as a fitting backdrop for the unraveling of the characters' lives. In the end, Royal Box offers a nuanced exploration of the complexities of human relationships and the often painful choices that individuals must make in their pursuit of happiness. Keyes does not provide easy answers or tidy resolutions, instead, she presents a world in which the lines between right and wrong, love and duty, are often blurred. The novel suggests that while society may impose certain expectations and constraints, true fulfillment can only be found by those who are willing to confront their own desires and take responsibility for their actions. Francis Parkinson Keyes's Royal Box is a richly textured novel that combines elements of romance, drama, and social commentary. Through its vivid characters and intricate plot, the novel offers a compelling examination of the human condition and the enduring conflict between individual desires and societal expectations.